Good day, guys and girls. My name's Jamie Gray, and welcome to another Landscape Contractor Magazine test drive. And look, we caught up with Justin from Kanga. How you going, bud? How you going, mate? Really well. Good to see you. Uh, and look, we've got Heath from Impact Pools and Landscapes. How are you, Heath? Good I wasn't going to forget about you then, That's I promise. Right, <laughs> so, Justin, look, what do you want to share with everybody about uh, the DT835 and some of the standout features? Mate, we've got the Australian-made DT835. 100% manufactured in Australia. Beautiful. Uh, it's a 35 horsepower Kubota engine, class leading. Um, we're on our, our over the wheel track system, yep. which is good for a smooth comfort ride. Yep. Uh, we've got the, the highest ground clearance from all mini loaders. Okay. Okay. And our bucket is self-leveling as well. There, and you were actually chatting with me before off camera. You were telling me about you were using the smaller version of this. So this is the largest in the range. Yes. Yes, and you were using the smaller one uh, in and around on the sand, and just how well it. Yeah. Yeah. It, it uh, just it just kept going. Yeah. I was in a half a foot deeper water. Yeah. And um, tides coming in, and it kept going. Um, really smooth operation. Yeah. And. You know, they're just user friendly. Excellent. Excellent. Perfect. And I had a bit of a go before. I haven't really spent any time on a machine like this before and very intuitive with the controls too, right? Easy to use. That's why hire companies love them. Yep. You know, within five minutes you've got a grasp, you know what you're doing. Yep. And they're easy to easy to use. We yep. keep them basic. We don't go for all the electronic dials and yeah. joysticks. We keep them basic so so they're user friendly and also service friendly. Awesome, mate. Sounds perfect. Well, Heath, should we uh, we get you in there? I know you've definitely spent a fair bit of time yeah. on this style of machine yeah, before, exactly, so exactly. no tricks today, okay? No, no tricks. No worries. All right, mate. Well, look, let's get Heath in there. We'll fire it up, uh, and we'll come back and have a chat with Heath real soon. No so, Tomo, mate, the Kanga, how'd she go? Uh, very impressive, Jamie. Yeah. Um, look, I've been on quite a few different machines through you know through my career so from a young bloke right up to now and and a lot of different ones and by far yep. um, I'm pretty impressed with this one mate it was very stable underfoot um, I think that's to do with the, the track system that they've got yep. um, at top speeds with a lot of weight um, I was actually trying to throw myself off and couldn't mate it's, it's very it's very good I'm yeah, very impressed awesome, awesome. Yeah. so I guess what it's a combination of uh, power the Kubota and then also the the controls what was the look I think the controls uh, just the, the bank of controls there nice solid handles lots of padding around your knees and your calves and things like that yep. but um, yeah look everything's really close there yep um, just the way that the whole handle situation is yep. um, it's not hard to just flick your finger across so yeah, perfect. Um, look, when the boom was up in the air it still had you know, so stable on the ground. So, cool. so um, as a landscaper, how would you, I guess, fit or work a machine like this into your workflow? Uh, look, running materials down the side of houses, um, bulk excavation, even straight up the side of the house when I'm doing the pools, yep. straight into a tipper. Yep. Um, it goes high enough to get into a reasonable sized truck. So that's that's a big feature with a four in one bucket as well. Yep. You're biting things, trying to pull trees out, that kind of thing. Yeah. Um, plenty of power to do that. So some of these logs today, that, you know, they're quite heavy and yep. um, it pulled them out with ease. So Heath, was there any other bits and pieces you wanted to include before we move uh, on? Look, confined spaces and stuff like that for me is a big thing. Underneath houses, through garages and things like that. So yep. this machine's got a Predator Cadillac exhaust system. Yep. Um, so it just reduces those emissions and stuff like that, obviously going through people's places and that they don't want to be getting diesel fumes and that in, the, in their house all day. So yep. um, that's pretty impressive as well. Yeah, awesome. And uh, when we had a chat with Justin before, he was mentioning even some of the contractors have been particularly using this machine in like tunnel contracts and stuff like that for that yeah. exact reason. Oh, look, so. I think the demo guys would love it as well. Yeah, um, awesome. So compact and it's, and it's rigid. It, it's all steel. Yep. It's Australian made. So that's a big thumbs up. Mate, can't beat it. Awesome. Good stuff, Tom. Thanks, Thanks, mate. mate. No worries. Heath, thanks so much for coming down no and being worries, our operator, mate. That Thank was you. awesome. Enjoyed it. And Justin, thanks so much for bringing the machine down, mate. She's passed no, with flying colours. No problems at all. It's good to get that feedback from people that use these sort of machines all the time. Awesome, mate. Awesome. So look, for everybody out there, they want to actually get on a demo model or come down and check out a machine, how do they get in contact? Contact one of our branches. Yep. We're all across the eastern seaboard. We've yep. got dealers throughout the country yep. and internationally. So awesome. jump on our website. 
or give us a call and we're happy to come out and help. Awesome, mate. Awesome. Can't beat a good Australian product. Awesome. Nah, that's for sure. Awesome. So thanks, guys and girls, for tuning in for another Landscape Contractor Magazine Test Drive. Make sure you check out the Kangaroo Range. Absolutely epic product. Till next time, stay really safe on site and we'll catch you soon.